Greetings family and friends. So grateful to see you all. I haven't done a live video on here in a while and I want to start doing that again. Earlier in my Facebook career, that was one of the best things, but these days hasn't been hitting the same. So I'm excited to be sharing a little more live content and less reels, uh, although I will be doing both. But in this video, I want to talk about those of you that are calling in the one and are actually tired of some of the dating games and some of the woes that I'm hearing a lot in my communities and with my clients as I work more and more with polarity relationships and intimacy. And I want to explain my philosophy on the difference between dating and courtship and how this relates to calling in the one versus dating, let's say, more casually or with less intention. And then, unfortunately, not getting what you want, not getting your needs met, not having your desires met at the highest level. So what I've really found that works is when you stop allowing yourself to be treated as a casual partner, when you stop, you know, saying yes to jumping into bed emotionally, psychologically, communicationally, connecting with someone that's actually not a good fit for your relationship goals, and you step back and get very clear with your criteria, with your vision, with your excitement around what courtship looks like for you, that's when the magic happens. That's when you meet the one. Now, dating, there's nothing wrong with dating. The way I define dating is much more of an exploration and you know, exciting phase of finding out what you like. It's a trial and error phase. You can still get your needs met. You can still have deep intimacy. You can still have amazing experiences. But often there's not a clear agreement set up there's also not clear container goals or vision for what that relationship will turn into or evolve into, which it will naturally. Let's just be clear here. The, the masculine's electric penetrative force and the feminine's magnetic womb power will create something, right? It literally creates children, but it's going to create something. So when you're dating casually and there's not agreement, so there's unsafety or those things aren't clear, well, often it creates drama. And this is what I hear all the time now. The danger here is to blame the external, right? Say, well, there's no good men out there. Oh, there's no good women out there. Or I keep attracting the same kind of partner. Therefore, all men are blank or all women just are blank. And these are all the traps that we can use when that little inner child, that innocent one is not getting their needs met and they're actually getting stuck in these relating patterns. So step one is take ownership and responsibility step two is get clear on exactly what you want you need to write down your full criteria and best case scenario for what you want in a partner and what kind of relationship container you want to create and also you should probably write out your non-negotiables what you're not willing to accept no matter what and this is critical to avoid overlooking the red flags and entering relationships that don't serve you which i think all of us can relate to right in the past so courtship is a higher level of dating. It's not for everyone. There's nothing wrong with people that maybe aren't calling this in at the time, but I hear more and more from people who want to call in the one, who want to enter a union style relationship. They want commitment. They want symbiotic, deep, passionate polarity between the masculine and feminine with them and their partner. So to show up in that way, you need to get clear. You probably need to be saying no more than you're saying yes. You need to be very discerning. You need to pace and determine how soon you'll become physically intimate and you need to be upfront and radically honest about your goals and vision for that relationship. And this is exactly what I'm going to be leading clients to through in my new program, Union, which I have two options. I have a six week abridged version, which is very much a quick start guide and a rapid container of accountability to get you set up on communication, polarity practice, getting really clear on what you want and then going after it. This is going to involve having a men's or women's community, being seen in your environment and your tribe. And whether you use dating apps, or you want to be in person at events and meeting people, matchmaking that way, you're going to have to show up with integrity. And so that's what I want to support you in doing. And I've had a lot of success the past year and a half supporting clients in this capacity. I also have a four month deep dive version, which is a VIP container for this union program. And so I'm really excited to uh, bring people in there. And if this is calling out to you or if this video is resonating with you, I'd love for you to send me a DM with the word union if you want to get set up with an interview. Or if this video has been powerful for you or you have something to share, tag someone in the comments. Let me know your thoughts down there and share this one out if it resonated. KO out. Grateful for you all.